Dusty and Toya to babysit for the first time. We want to get baby cup to sleep. I just wonder how it's going. It's Renee here, and I've just been trying to help little Katie Rose and Kai today. They've been pretty fussy. Here you go, Kai. I'm, I'm not sure really what the problem is, but they've been a lot of work. Oh, that's an alarm. Oh, I forgot about it. It's time for me to leave for my 10.30 hair appointment. What am I gonna do with the babies? I haven't had my hair cut or trimmed in over six months. I definitely need it. But the babies are so fuzzy today and they just want mom. I don't know what I should do. Don't cry, Fuzz. Poor little babies. They just must not be feeling well. But what should I do about my appointment? Oh, I know. Christy and Toria could babysit for the first time. Let's go ask them. What should we do today? I don't know. I wish we could help mom somehow. Hey, girls. What would you think of babysitting for the first time while I go get my hair cut? Well, I know you girls will do just great, but I have to tell you, they've been so fussy this morning. They just want me to hold them. Don't worry, Mom. We got this completely under control. Okay, here's Katie Rose. And Toya, here's baby Carl. He definitely has liked his passy this morning. He's been a little bit fussy. Oh, and here's his lovey. Well, before I leave, girls, I've got a couple instructions to go over with you. The first thing I need to make sure the girls need to do is how to feed the babies. <laughs> it's a lot of yeah. So mm -hmm. yucky. Okay, we went over feeding. Now it's time to go over changing. I sure hope they don't have any stinkies. And the last thing on the list, girls, is napping. And they've been so fussy. I, I hope they'll nap for you girls. First thing they get is a pacifier, and then of course their little lovey, and a kiss, and then I just lay them down. But he's fussing right now because he just wants to be held, so girls, I know you're gonna have your hands full. I hope that they're good for you. This is kind of a rough start to your first babysitting. The baby's so sad. So. Girls, how do you feel about all this? Do you think you can babysit? I think so. What do you think, Toya? I think we can do this. Okay, girls. Well, I'm going to leave my phone with you. Make sure to text if you have any questions or if anything comes up. And remember, Dad is upstairs 
if there's any emergency. But I'm sure you've got this all under control. I'll see you later. Don't worry, I see. Well, to be honest, I'm a little bit nervous about leaving Christy and Toya for the first time babysitting, but I know they can do it. They're so good with babies, and I've got to get this hair cut. I'll show you how long it is in just a bit. Let's go to the car. Okay, so I just got up to the car, and I promised you I'd show you what my hair looks down. Look at how long this is. It's overdue. Okay, here we go. Hey Kai, Kai is getting kind of fussy too. Be bad at that the list. Good idea. The first thing we need to do is feeding. Wow, this is a lot of work. It is. It's okay, baby Kai. I know you love your mommy, but other people like me and Toya love you too. We love baby Tiffany. Oh, eat that part. I know nothing. Oh my goodness. That looks kind of. Funny. You want to see it? Oh, mama, hand thumbs up, okay? <laughs> We're trying to get baby cut to sleep. <laughs> Mom has such a dent. Oh, hold up, pamphlet. See, Twisty? Oh, yeah. It looks like she got her hair washed. We finally got the babies to sleep. Wow, be, I'm hungry. Me too. Let's go see if we find a snack. How about some chocolate? Sounds perfect. get that all done. How do you like my new haircut? She trimmed it up quite a bit and highlighted it. But I just can't stop thinking about Christy and Toria and Katie Rose and Kai. I just wonder how it's going, but I'm so glad that they're very responsible. Wow, that chocolate was good. I wish I could want icing tea. Sissy, we need to clean up this mess. Katie Rose, you are 
how Katie Rose and Kai did. What do you girls think about it? Do you like it? What do I you think about it? I love it. I'm so glad you like it, girls. But the real question I have is how did it go? It went well. It was great. Oh, My identical twin sister is getting married. It's an aunt, she, she's wedding. I don't know why Katie Rose, she's gotten up twice. I think she's burning up with a fever. And what does that mean for the wedding? I can't take a baby with a fever there. Katie Rose's bedtime bottle is ready. Are you yeah. girls so excited about our big day tomorrow? Yeah. Tomorrow is the biggest day. It's Aunt Cece's wedding. I can't wait. Now you girls sleep well. Good night, Katie Rose. Rose. It's been a long day and we want to be well rested for the day that we waited for all year. I just can't wait to put on my well, dress and my wedding suits for the first time. I see you yeah, to look like princesses. Even baby Ella and Katie Rose is going to be a well for the first time. Yeah. Well, you go to sleep, girls. I'll get everything ready. My identical twin sister is getting married. Oh, I am so excited. Her name is Cece. We've been getting ready for this wedding for an entire year. It's going to be a super small and private wedding with just our immediate families. And the girls are so thrilled to be flower girls for the first time. Take a look at baby Emma's little dress shoes. Now the last thing I need to do before I can go to sleep tonight is wrap up my twin sister's wedding presents. This is just so exciting for me. I've waited for my twin sister to get married for years. One more gift. It's an American flag. They are gonna live in America right now. Where all do you live? Well, the last thing that needs to be done before the wedding is a good night of sleep. Everything's ready. And I'm glad, because I'm tired. And it's gonna be a huge, exciting day. The day we've waited for for months. Why Katie Rose? She's gotten up twice. I'm not sure if her blindness is has anything to do with it or she's just, I don't know. I've got to get to bed. It's three o'clock.
the vlog. I did not sleep well last night, and neither did Katie Rose. So pretty baby girl. Wait a minute. She feels hot. I think she's burning up with a fever. I'm gonna have to take her temperature. <laughs> Let's go try her temperature. Don't cry, Katie Rose. Okay, Katie Rose. Oh, it's ready. Oh, no. It's a 101 point fever. Oh, poor Katie Rose. And what does that mean for the wedding? I can't take a baby with a fever there. Oh, no. I mean, she's gonna have to miss the wedding, but who would take care of her? Oh, you know what? I'm actually feeling not so great either. I've got a headache coming on, and I think I feel warm. I think I'm gonna go check on Chris Tutoria and baby Emma. I wonder how they're doing. This is the morning of a wedding. the night. I've been up with a fever. Well, I just took Katie Rose's temperature. I guess I'll take yours too. I can't believe it. This is the morning of the wedding. Oh my, yours is even higher than Katie Rose. It's 101.1. Not good. It's the hottest of them all. 102. Poor baby Emma, do you want me to check yours? Close your mouth and your tongue. Oh my. 102.1. There's no way we could go to the wedding today. With our sore throats and high temperatures, I wonder if this is strep. What's strep? Strep is a highly contagious sickness with a sore throat and a high fever. Come on, let's go sit out on the couch. I'm so sorry I don't get to see your sister get married, Mommy. Oh, there's my phone. Hello? What's the matter? I woke up with pink eye this morning and I can't open my eye. I'm gonna have to put a patch over it. It hurts so bad. Oh dear. I just don't know what to do. Well, we'll just calm down. I think because it's such a small wedding, I think I better just postpone it till next week. Huxley understands too and we both agree that's would probably be best, but I just feel so horrible for Christy, Tori, and baby Emma. I know they've looked forward to it, and I didn't want to disappoint them. Okay, well, well, don't worry about it. We'll just plan on next Saturday. Okay, bye-bye. Girls, you'll never guess. We need to come up with a plan to get better. We need to do that, quick. There's other things that we can do to help though. The next thing I think we should do is rest. <laughs> rest is sometimes the very best medicine. Let's all take a little nap together. Mommy, I stand up here and do what do you see me to do now? I guess we could have a little bit of resting and reading time now. 
Does that sound good? Yeah. Okay, let's rest and read. That sounds great, Mom. Good night, Moon. Oh. In the great green room, there was a telephone and a red balloon. Another animal with suckers is resting in the tide pool. One. Fun. Wow, we read 43 books. What that's Reading is a great sensitivity, but we've mm. got to keep moving. We've got to get to the next thing to make us feel better. Are you ready? Yeah. Wow, this has been a huge day of rest, water, and vitamins. I know, Mom. And we just have to repeat this for the next six days. Do you think you can do that, baby Emma? I think so, too. Boy, I sure hope this helps us get over this so we can go to Aunt Cece's wedding next week. Wow, girls, can you believe that we've been taking vitamins and resting mm -hmm. for six days? Days. I can't believe tomorrow's the wedding. Before then, let's check our temperatures one last time to make sure we don't have a fever. Looks normal. Looks perfect. And Christy. How does it look? Good. Now it's my turn. Yes, perfect normal body temperature. Now Katie Rose's turn. Hers is normal too. Well girls, we're the night before the wedding again. Why such the sad faces, girls? We're feeling better and tomorrow's the wedding. We should be so happy. I think something else will come up that we can't go to the wedding tomorrow. I know. Let's read B dots it. And Aunt Cece got pink eye. I wonder if something else will happen tonight. We really want to do real flower dresses for the first time. Oh, I know. But we'll just hope everything works out okay. Does that feel good, girls? I sure hope so. <laughs> I sure hope you sleep through the night, little Katie Rose. Good night. Well, good night, girls. We'll see you in the morning. <laughs> straight through. Katie Rose must have too. Let's go check on the girls. Girls, how are you feeling today? Great! I can't Whoa. wait for the wedding today. How are Katie Rose is doing? Good question. Let's take a peek and see. She's doing so good. I hear her little baby sounds. She's happy. Okay, girls. Well, we've got some things to do to get ready for the wedding. There's always so much to do during any time we go out and get ready, but especially at this wedding for Aunt Cece. There's bows to tie, shoes to put on, makeup to do, hair to fix, dresses to put on. It's so much fun, yeah. isn't it? I got new shoes. I thought I'd put some curls into Christy's hair. We're gonna see how this works. Are you excited? Yeah. You're gonna look like a princess. Have you ever been in a wedding before? Are you ready to see it? Yeah. Okay. <gasps> wow! How do you like it? I love it. Do you wanna put on your own lipstick, Christy? Sure. Are you excited for the wedding, baby Emma? Oh, look at how princess like you look. Sometimes doing hair is a little bit more challenging with baby Emma also. Isn't it, baby Emma? Yeah. Of course. But I think it's working along just fine. I thought I'd put her hair in a little fancy updo. Oh. Okay, I wanna see the friend, baby Emma. Okay, baby Emma, we're ready for the big reveal. Let's see your face. Oh, baby Emma. Did you do that? Uh oh. Uh oh, it's right. Let's see if I can clean that. Boy, you put a lot on. I I'm think done. you look beautiful now. 
Let's see you smile. This morning has gone well, but it's been a little bit crazy. Lady Rose has slept through just about the whole thing, but now we all need to get her dressed. Victoria, thank you for helping me get her ready. There she goes, the very last. Kitty Rose, oh. Okay, who would like to put the hat on baby Kitty Rose? ready and has so much energy. So we just made it to the wedding chapel where the wedding is gonna be and the girls are having so much fun dancing in their fun dresses and we're just waiting for Aunt Cece to come. Oh, girls, oh girls, I think Aunt Cece is calling you back. Girls, come on in. Well, girls, while we wait for the wedding, let's watch a special playlist of Katie Rose's flying journey and her days. Let's watch it together. Yeah. 